Yo, what's going on guys, your boy Physical and I am bringing you another gameplay today, so two videos in one day, that's something, you know, I haven't done in quite a while, so it's some achievement for me to post two videos in one day, but anyways, it's a MAA1 nuclear gameplay watching on the map carrier, playing some multi-team hardpoint, and I mentioned the fact that, you know, I'm going to be mixing up on different maps and different weapons, just to kind of keep you a bit fresh, try to get some more nuclears on the DLC maps as well, to keep you a bit more fresh as well, you know what I mean, so... Uh, and also with the weapon balance, switching it up with different sort of weapons because obviously you don't want to see the same old weapons over and over again so I'll be mixing it up in that aspect so let's just get into the topic which I want to talk about uh, the fact that the PS4 and the Xbox One we've kind of got a gist at the moment of you know the consoles and stuff not everything obviously because you know there's still a lot more to be revealed at E3 but you know we've you know, got a rough basis on what the consoles are kind of going to be offering uh, to us at this time but Xbox have kind of kept it um, you know hidden at this moment they've talked a lot about the entertainment factor that they bring into their new console and stuff like that and PS4 have kind of you know just gone straight in uh, talked about a lot of the games that they're gonna be bringing new sort of games as well so um, it's really exciting to hear and all this stuff so seeing though my channel is based around Call of Duty I'm gonna be obviously looking for the best console that provides Call of Duty and as of now I've just heard that you know, Xbox One, um, Treyarch, Activision, whoever it is, have signed another deal. I don't know how long for, uh, for the next Call of Duty, you know, exclusive content and stuff like that will be purchased on the Xbox One first. Um, I think this deal is going to be the same thing, a one month uh, earlier than any other platform. So that's something which um, Microsoft have sorted out already uh, with their Activision or Treyarch. So. That's something good there and seeing though I've been playing on the Xbox a lot lately um, I might you know consider buying the Xbox one first but I'm not too sure because I'm literally gonna be playing on the console that you know plays better and obviously Call of Duty is known for playing better on the Xbox so it might be me playing on the Xbox again but don't get me wrong I will be buying both consoles because you know some of the games that you can play on the PS4 or the PS3 at this moment in time are, are games that I really do enjoy playing so uh, I'll still be buying both of them. I don't know which one I'll be buying first, but um, time will tell. Obviously, which one I'll be buying first, anyways. But let me know if you guys have, you know, have pre-ordered any, you know, put down any money down for pre-orders on the consoles, because you can actually put money down for the pre-orders on the console, so you can basically guarantee that you'll be getting one on the day it is released. Um, I have put some money down at the moment. Obviously, you can, you, you got the chance of changing it to, you know. If you don't want to get the Xbox One, you can put that money towards the PS4. That's how it works in here in, in the UK anyway. So I don't know if that's the same around the world. But let me know if you guys have put any kind of pre-orders down. And if you've actually put any pre-order down for the new card, the new Call of Duty Ghost. Because obviously you do get that free camo as well. That ghosty ghost camo that you get. Uh, which is pretty nice, I think. I got mine yesterday. And also the new camos have been, you know, available on store. Xbox 360. I'm not too sure if it's out on the PS3 as of yet, but they are on the Xbox Live Market Store uh, to buy. I think it's Cyborg and the other one is Dragon. They're the two that have been, you know, nominated for the top picks. Uh, so you can go buy them. There's 160 Microsoft points if you want to buy them. So uh, I might go buy Cyborg. I'm not too sure. I'm trying to find out uh, from friends which one's better, and I will be purchasing that. And hopefully, I can get a nuclear gameplay tonight with it so uh, this gameplay is actually wrapping up right now i just got my nuclear hopefully you've enjoyed this video please leave a like if you have comment and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you on my next video peace out